ass for fame, you son of a bitch. Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. And we're back with more of Mass Effect 3. And this is Cinderius Shepard. And we have just completed two of the uh, major DLCs, Leviathan and Omega. And now it is time to resume our game and the completion of Mass Effect 3. All right, so we were told that we had some messages. Let's go ahead and take a look. All right, from Arya Talok, a memento. Sent you a little souvenir of our adventures on Omega, Shepard. Fitting enough, the king sustained a crack. Not sure what that means. And ST and R weapons research, collector armaments. We have completed our analysis of the weapons your team recovered. The components are unique, a hybrid of both organic and mechanical parts, and seem to form a link directly to the collectors wielding it. We have adapted this technology for, for production and will continue research to improve the weapon's performance. I have allocated replicas for your use. Either collect them at the Spectre requisitions when you are next on the Citadel or we can have it shipped directly to you. All right. Trainer, is there anything else I need to know? Commander. All right, I guess not. Um, I think this is it, people. Let's get to the galaxy map. All right, and we do have the Citadel DLC. We'll see, you know, after the ending of Mass Effect, if we can do this and if it would even be appropriate. But the, the happy ending <laughs> for me is probably going to be enough. But we'll see. All right. So we're heading to the Horsehead Nebula. All right. And we're heading to assault the elusive man's base. And the worrisome thing, though, about this is that I didn't make it to level 60. We still might, but we are so close. I think we're at level 58. I would have liked to have been at 60 before we've done all this, but here we go. Krona Station. Okay, the MLA, M Mila Red Supergiant, Anadius, is a minor footnote on the star maps of the Horsehead Nebula. A cold dying star about 20 solar masses and 1500 times Sol's radius. Not listed on any charts, an unobtrusive space station is nearly imperceptible in the star's periodic bursts of solar output. Edie's advisory. The size and shape of the station suggests many ships could dock in it. Precise measurements would require active scans, which could reveal the Normandy's presence. Given the stakes, this level of accuracy is not recommended. All right, attack. Shepard, the intel you sent looks good. The fleets are ready to go. But? Once we're committed against Cerberus, it won't be long before the Reapers take notice. And the Crucible? Oh boy. Ready. Except for the Catalyst. But there's no way to hide the ships we'll be sending at Cerberus. Once we attack, the Crucible won't stay safe for long. For all intents and purposes, an assault on Cerberus will be the first stage of our attack on Earth. All right, people, you see that. And that's the thing about uh, 3 that I didn't particularly care for. It's like, you know, ready or not, you know, here's the Crucible. It's done. And, you know, we were, I was still trying to collect uh, 
assets and all this kind of stuff. But, oh, it's done. Okay. In the game. But anyway, if we don't find the catalyst... What happens if Cerberus doesn't have the intel we need? Or they stop us from getting it? Then we lead the fleets to Earth and we take our chances. But your intel points to Cerberus and the elusive man holding the information we're looking for. And we have the element of surprise. Cerberus won't know what hit him. We go now. The Reapers and Cerberus started this. Now we're gonna end it. I'll get the fleets mobilized. Alright people, here we go. Here we go. But first, a moment of I tenderness. I wondered where you were. Edie didn't tell you? She respects your privacy. Not like me. What are you doing? I thought I heard the casing crack during that last fight. The bullet must have just grazed me. Do you feel ready, Shepard? Hmm. What about you? You first. Huh. Very fair. What I want most is for this war to end, while there's still a galaxy left to save. And everyone's counting on you to do that for us. It must be overwhelming. I'm good to go. I've been ready since I saw the Reapers land on Earth. I can't pretend to be surprised. We have one chance. Just one. I'm not losing that. You won't. At any rate, let's not dwell on that tonight. <sighs> it would be easy for a single ship to get lost up there, wouldn't it? Yeah. It would. To find some place very far away, where you could spend the rest of your life in peace. And happiness. I'm happy with you here. Right now, there's no place I'd rather be. Neither would I. You mean so much to me. I love you. I love you, Liara Tassoni. I... I love you too. Nothing like making love in a cocoon of biotic energy. Oh boy, here it is, the final dream, or nightmare. Oh, let's chase him. Got no choice. Chase this little brat. Past the oily shadows.
You can't sleep? We're almost there. Already? I hope everyone is ready. You don't need to worry about that. You rallied who you could. The Reapers won't get any more chances to divide us. This time, the galaxy follows our lead. We'll lead them to victory. We'll win. That's a promise. You're not alone in this fight now, Shepard. Take strength from that. Thanks, Liara. My pleasure. The strike team is in. We've got our foothold. Fifth Fleet, all forward. I don't want a single server ship in my sky when we're through. Shepard, I should accompany you on this mission. Why? This is the central point of operations for Cerberus. They will have enhanced security measures. With my knowledge of Cerberus algorithms and this body's updated protocols, I offer the best chance to help you succeed. Grab your gear. All right, so Edie is in. Who else are we going to take? Hmm. Well, it's going to be Shepard's longtime buddy, Garrus. All right, we'll go with this armor. We'll keep these weapons, and let's see, I think everybody else has uh, got the correct weapons. All right, we have a few more points. Oh, we're level 59. We're, oh, I think we will hit 60. Alright, so we have enough pull to pull the shields off these people. We'll go ahead and max out the armor piercing ammo. Let's see, increase health and armor damage. Or increase armor's cover penetration. And decrease the effectiveness of armored targets. Hmm. Oh, I'm just gonna go with damage. Staying away from the proximity mines. Okay. Reduce power speed penalty or increase damage protection. Uh, we're going to reduce the power speed penalty. And uh, I don't know about decoy. I guess we can give her the points. I've never really found much use for decoy. But we'll give it to her. All right, let's go. Joker, what's our status? We've got a foothold, but it's not much, Commander. A lot of fighters guarding the launch base. Can you get us in? Hey, I got us to Ilos. I can do this. It might be a bumpy ride, though. Do what you can. Shepard, I am ready. Wait, wh what? Are you crazy? You can't go to Cerberus headquarters. They could have a virus or a kill switch or... I will be fine, Jeff. Head to the shuttle, Edie. Fifth Fleet's cut through their line. They're regrouping. Now's as good a time as any. Sorry, Joker. I know it hurts. Not being able to go with her. <laughs> yeah, it sucks. Thanks for bringing that up. Hey, Shepard. Keep her safe. Same to you.
All right, armor piercing for the squad. Oh, uh, Edie is already down. All right. And you have got nothing. I may be low on, uh... Is back. I don't know how. All right, double overload. Cluster grenade. More. All right, now come on. Mech down. Alright, I don't think we're close enough. Oh, is that Edie? Okay. intends to vent the hangar bay. Can you stop them? I need an active console. Try the upper level. Okay. Let me get some... I think we're... full on our ammo. Let's go. Hangar 16 secured. Engaging Achilles protocol. Shepard, we need to find a console and stop servers from venting the hangar. Understood. I feel like I might have missed something though but downstairs, but I guess we're good. Edie, I've got a console. Go! Hangar vent procedure. Disable. Can you open the hangar? No. However, I can access their fighter launch controls. Shepard, Cerberus is aware that the venting attempt failed. Reinforcements are inbound. Alright, let's keep moving, people. Another Cerberus team is inbound. Guess they figured out what we're doing. They're not stopping us now. Oh my goodness, one shot? All right. Overload. Oh, sorry, Edie. Did I take your cover? All yours incinerate with prejudice. Okay, let's keep moving, people. All right, here we go. Rotation controls. Overriding safeties. The fighter should now launch to the hangar door. 
Perfect. Let's get down there. Escape the hangar. Anything else? Ammo and a PDA with 5,000 credits. Not that I think we're probably going to need to buy anything at this point in the game. Oh, yeah, this is, um, oh, there's nothing down here. Wait, here it is clamp release. Launching fighter. The central lab was located behind this hangar. I suggest we follow the fighter's path. Noted. Let's move. Oh, boy. Intruder alert. All personnel they spare no expense. Alright, Edie, can we get incineration up there? Good. Uh-oh. Man down. Garrus is down. Oh, good. The shields are off. Okay, that mech was on easy mode. Okay, Garrus, up and at him. That mech was on easy mode. He didn't have shields. I mean, come on now. Uh-oh. Is there another one? Oh, there he is. Look out. Oh! Where's my where's my squad? Double overload, people. All right, we got. Let's go. Uh-oh, we got more. And what's this? An M37 Falcon. All right, it's time for a save. Edie, can you get past me? One moment. Cerberus has updated their encryption. There may be a slight delay as I bypass security. What are they doing now? How's Cerberus reacting to us breaching the door? They are sealing off as much of the base as they can. Most obvious routes to the central lab are blocked. Other areas are being fortified. Heavy troopers will attempt to delay us while engineers set up turrets. Any more surprises like venting the hangar? No. I am aware of this facility's safeguards and can counteract them. Cerberus can merely slow us down. All right, finish with the door. Let me know when you're through. I am through. We must proceed through a sublevel to avoid Cerberus containment measures. Where do you think we'll find the Prothean VI? A central lab at the heart of this facility. It is the most secure area. Following the destruction left by the fighter will offer the most direct route. All right. I don't know. This flammable symbol probably isn't good. All right. Incineration. <laughs> no, I'm not. Let's not. Okay, we'll we'll do concussive shot. Oh, nice. Thank you. 
Garrus Oak, well, we don't really need Overload. Concussive shot. have its uses. They're wasting a lot of troops trying to stop us. Their intention is to delay us, not stop us. Engineers are currently preparing an organized defense ahead. They can waste that many troops? Yes. Cerberus employs Reaper augmentation on captured civilians to create functional shock troops quickly. Just like the Reapers did with the Collectors, turning victims into shock troops. Yes. Alright, so we got 5,000 credits, we got some meta gel. Let's get to climbing. We will be through momentarily. Shepard, that console has not been fully scrubbed. It contains data you may find interesting. What am I looking at? Project Lazarus, your reconstruction. Wow, let's look at the first entry. It can't be done. It's not a matter of resources. It's always a matter of resources. We're not losing Shepard. Sir, Shepard is clinically brain dead. After that much trauma, that long with no oxygen, we cannot overcome nature. Operative Lawson disagrees. She is now in charge of Project Lazarus. I didn't realize it was that bad. Hmm. Pretty stark. You okay? I'm a little overwhelmed. I'm still me. I doubt I'd have been able to turn against Cerberus otherwise. I don't remember anything. Maybe they really just fixed me, or maybe I'm just a high-tech VI that thinks it's Commander Shepard. But I don't know, I... Be surprising if it didn't mess you up a little. Let's look at the second entry. Tissue regeneration is proceeding. The helmet kept the brain intact for whatever good that will do. Lawson will find a way. Sir, Shepard's an Alliance soldier. As far as he knows, we're a terrorist organization. Shepard's a soldier. He knows the Reapers are the real threat. He'll work with us. He really had you boxed in. I was wrong? Every instinct I had told me not to trust the Cerberus. But I needed their help. So I played along. You did what you had to, Shepard. And I was there with you. Let's look at the third entry. Project Lazarus is reporting neurological activity. They're requesting more funding. Granted. Get me our potential recruits file. Shepard will be up soon. We need a crew. Our existing forces should be more than sufficient. No. We need sympathetic faces. I need Shepard invested. Tap Kelly Chambers and recruit Donnelly. I imagine Miss Daniels will follow. We want some old friends as well. Contact Dr. Chakwas and send me the psych profile on Shepard's pilot, along with a bottle of 47 Thessia Red. Sneaky little bastard. Use them to keep you from seeing the real Cerberus. Mm. Wow, let's close the log. How's that door coming, Edie? We are clear to proceed. Okay. Ah, we've got something else here. Cirrus Council Greaves. Incursion team, what's your status? We've cleared the hangar and are inside the base. Good work. Do you need support? Negative. Keep the heat on. We'll find what we need. Where's my barrier? Okay, it's just not showing up. There we go. Am I going the right way? I guess so. Uh oh. Double overload. Just 
disabling their shield pylon. It's already disabled, Edie. Keep up. We have got... Who's got overload? Nobody? Alright. Overload and incinerate. Look out. Easy, look out. Okay. Double overload since we've got it available. down. Alright, when you say flank us, from where? We must stop the engineers before they take more turrets. Alright, Garrus. And Edie, double overload. All right, we got through. Okay, I don't see anything. And in this late stage of the game, I don't know if I'm going to keep hunting for stuff. There's probably nothing here anyway. All right, let's do a save. And let's climb. I will bypass the lock. If you are interested, the console nearby is still functional. Okay. It's not that console. Ah, uh, it's this console. First entry. Second entry. Our sims indicate that the enhanced defense intelligence gives the highest combat improvement on frigates. Anything heavier, and the ships react too slowly to benefit from Edie's advice. Edie? Oh, that's uh, it, well, the boys in the lab came up with a name for her. For it. Good work. I'll take your recommendations on planned installation. Sir, she. it. 
can be very persuasive. If it were to turn a crewman, convince them to disable the shackles, well... It's a cyber warfare suite, Doctor. Nothing more. God, I like how he said, Edie? <laughs> Third entry. What about the backups? I'm sorry, sir. None of Normandy's surveillance feeds have been responding since Shepard went rogue. I want it back. Retried the remote lockdown protocols. After our last attempt, Edie flooded our server with seven zettabytes of explicit images. I think she was making a joke. It doesn't make jokes, Doctor. Allocate a team for a new project. Codename Eva. This time we'll ensure it stays loyal. Eva Corre, people. We met her on Mars. All right. You helped us. You never told me about Cerberus trying to shut down the Normandy. You had more pressing issues. The situation was under control. Seven Zeta Bytes? Most of it was Jeff's. That was... A joke. I know. And thank you. All right, let's go. Uh... I guess we're going through this door. Another security lock. I can bypass it. Incursion team, are you still with us? We're limiting it fire as best we can. Admiral, we're in deep and the Prothean VI will be in the safest part of the station. Don't hold back. This isn't Torfin Shepard. I'm not risking you unless I have to. I'll be fine. Just take Cerberus down. Please. Understood, Commander. All ships, you're free to fire. Hmm. Alright, let's get the PDA. And 5,000 credits. Let's see, do we need any more ammo? We're good. Look at the cigarette. Does this mean... The elusive man was in here? Huh. Let's keep going. Is that our way? I don't think so. Well, maybe it is. Alright, but there's a door up here. Let's go look. And let's see if anything behind this crate. Nope. Alright, we've got med kit. And Delum Core Overlay. Not sure what that is. That'd be a generator. Looks like the fifth fleet's coming through. They'll get it done. And another console. Let's look at the first entry. Second entry. I could have taken him. Absolutely. But the Council was your priority, not Shepard. Because of him, the Council is still in power. Shepard is keeping the Reapers occupied while our research progresses. But as it happens, I believe you'll find your chance for a rematch. Head to Thessia. Shepard will be there soon. And I want you waiting. Hmm. Third entry. Here it is. Excellent. The Prothean VI should enable us to determine the nature of the catalyst. Combined with the breakthrough at Sanctuary, we have everything we need. We just need to tie up a few loose ends. Like Shepard? He should have died on Thessia. Should I finish him? No. I'm not writing Shepard off as a total loss just yet. For now, Sanctuary gave us a proof of concept for controlling the Reapers. And made it a target. Miranda Lawson. Get the data from Sanctuary. If Miranda gets in your way, deal with her. It will be a pleasure, sir. All right. 
right. More background. Looks like Edie's work is done. Let's keep going. Let's get a save in here. Did we just come through this way? What were you opening, Edie? I thought you were opening a... a, a a door. Alright, I guess that's it. We do have to go back and I think down into that darkened area. This is just one of those out of the way Easter eggs if you don't explore. I don't know if you would call that an Easter egg, but if you don't explore the station, you don't get the information. left of it. I'm surprised Cerberus recovered that much from the base. All those colonists kidnapped, processed into that, and Cerberus hangs it up like a trophy. The elusive man convinced me to work with him to save the colonies. But he never really cared, did he? I think he did. He just cares more about studying it. The dead are only a statistic now. Somehow, that seems even worse. Cerberus is actively using the surviving pieces. The central core, analogous to the heart, is largely intact. I believe Cerberus is using it for a power source. Alright, let's keep moving. Uh oh. Guess we're getting close. Yep. What do we need here? All right, I think we're going to double overload and warp. Mm, more phantoms. Let's get in another save. I don't want to have to go through that again, even though that really wasn't that difficult. Look at this. The remains of that human reaper. That was some battle. It was quite fun, though. Shooting those injection tubes. I thought hospitals were ugly to fight through. This is so much worse. At least it's not trying to kill us this time. All right, we got more phantoms. Let's see, what can we do? else. 
You just have to stop and wonder every now and then. We've done it! Level 60! <laughs> All right. Let's look for active consoles. I use a PDA. Ah, here we are. First entry. Second entry. The performance upgrades are off the charts. Our troops can outfight any Alliance soldier. Roll it out. I want all troopers fitted with implants before the Reapers arrive. Hmm. I'm still concerned about us losing control of our forces. Some of them are already hearing voices. When our work as Sanctuary pays off, the only voice they'll be hearing is ours. All right. Third entry. my opinion on this. It's too dangerous. No. We're close. Sanctuary was a success. We can control Reaper forces. Everything we've been fighting for, every sacrifice we've made, it's about to pay off. We can't lose you, sir. Humanity needs your mind, and they need it intact. I understand the danger, Janna. That's why I'm trusting you with this. As long as you're here, I know you'll keep me in line. I'm holding you to that, sir. Okay. Begin the procedure. No anesthetic. Computer, end recording. Alright, so he has injected himself with Reaper Tech. Alright, let's keep going. Uh-oh. These type of hallways are never... Never good. It's an interesting design. Alright, let's go. This is it. Stay sharp, everyone. Locate the Prothean VI. Shepard, you're in my chair. This chair is about the only damn thing you have left. Cerberus is finished. On the contrary, we have achieved everything I ever imagined. Almost everything. Yeah. We all saw what you accomplished on Sanctuary. But it's not the same as controlling a Reaper. A significant hurdle. But thanks to the Prothean VI, I have what I need to make it a reality. The Catalyst? Yes. So, what is it? What is the Catalyst? And how exactly will it help you control the Reapers? You'll have to ask the VI yourself. I'm done helping you. When did you start? Hmm. You think because I'm willing to use the enemy's tactics that they're no longer my enemy? Everything, Shepard, everything I've done has uplifted humanity. 
not only above other species in our galaxy, but over the Reapers. Uh-oh, people. You know we cannot turn down a renegade option. You're in this for yourself. Bullshit. If you were willing to do everything it took, you'd have worked with me. I don't think so. You're desperate. How many have you killed? Together, we would already have the Crucible and the Catalyst. You wouldn't listen. You're still not listening. Destroying the Reapers would be the biggest mistake of our brief existence. And nothing you can say will ever convince me otherwise. I can't help you anymore. I've given you every chance to listen to reason. Cerberus is done. And so are you. Once again, you fail to recognize the truth. Cerberus isn't just an organization or the people behind it. Cerberus is an idea. That idea is not so easily destroyed. Besides, I've already acquired what you're looking for. Edie, I've almost got it. Edie, I'm surprised at you. Working so hard to bring about the Reaper's destruction. Don't listen to him. You could have destroyed Eva's body, but instead, you chose to control it. It was necessary. My point, exactly. Hmm. I've got it. Online. Security breach detected. Enjoy your little chat, but don't overstay your welcome. You are attempting to recover me from indoctrinated forces? Yes. I need to know what the catalyst is. Security protocols have been overridden. I will comply. The catalyst enhances dark energy transmissions and coordinates the entire mass relay network. In your cycle, it is known as the Citadel. What? The catalyst is the Citadel. The Citadel? So the Crucible and Citadel together can stop the Reapers. That is correct. But the Citadel was built by the Reapers. The plans for the Crucible were passed down to us from the previous cycle, and countless cycles before that. At some point, it is difficult to pinpoint when. The Crucible plans were adapted to incorporate the use of the Catalyst. Presumably, the Crucible was not sufficiently powerful to defeat the Reapers. So we used their own technology against them. Precisely. This is critical information. If you'd told me sooner, we could have planned for this. It was feared that if the Reapers were aware of the Catalyst's intended use, they would retake control of it. I am programmed to withhold that information until the Crucible is complete. It's as ready as it's gonna be. Let's get it to the Citadel. That may no longer be possible. Why not? The one who broke through my security protocols, the one you call the Elusive Man, has fled to the Citadel and informed the Reapers of our purposes. Damn it! Then the Citadel is in danger. The Reapers will take control of it. They already have. The Citadel has been moved to the Reaper control space. Moved? To where? To the system you refer to as Soul. Earth. Correct. The Reaper forces will now consolidate power around the Catalyst and protect it at all costs. The odds of accessing it are remote. <laughs> we knew this day was coming. We were gonna face the Reapers head on eventually. It doesn't really matter where it happens. We'll get the Crucible to Earth. I hope you find success. Edie, get me hacked. Edie. Edie. Not so fast. You. He did warn you not to overstay your welcome.
double overload. Oh my god, my health. Goodness, I've used up all my ammo? All right, we need double overload. Gotcha. All right, we still have phantoms. Amen. The Citadel is in position. The Reapers are preparing to complete their harvest of your species. I'll stop them. It is too late. I recommend investigating it. I'll stop them. Barely. I assume you've heard about the Citadel. Just now. Do we know what's going on? Why it's here? The Citadel is the catalyst. Thanks to the elusive man, the Reapers are now aware that we know. And so they moved it here to protect it? As far as I can tell. What does this mean for the Crucible? I'll talk to Hackett about that, but... It looks like our plan is even more desperate now. Agreed. I've got a team in London. The Reapers have been preparing for something here. Now, we know what for. We'll scout it out. Try to find out as much as we can. Roger that. Well, at least we'll be seeing you sooner rather than later. Be careful, sir. You too, Shepard. Anderson out. Okay. Major defeat, second battle of the Citadel. Look at all this money. What am I going to do with it? All right. Priority Earth. 
Looks like that's where we're headed, people. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Let's wait for all these things to clear. Second Battle of the Citadel. Attack on Kamala. Sorry, Second Fleet. Citadel Fleet. Citadel Support. Asari 6th Fleet, Alliance 5th Fleet, Batarian Fleet. All right, and a codex on the Asari Rebellions. Okay, let's look at our war assets. Oh my goodness. So we never got maximum uh, military strength. I don't know what's going to happen with this level. <laughs> I said... I hope we can win. I don't know. All right, so. Oh, here's the Talon Saboteurs. Cerberus Weapon Stockpiles. Asari 2nd and 6th Fleets. Oh, we've got some more Geth, the Geth Fleet. I mean, it's amazing. All this stuff that I've got, and I'm still... Not at the the full bar here. All right, we have Aria Talok. I mean, even doing the DLCs, we don't have the full bar. And if I recall, this may be bad news that uh, things don't turn out as we'd like them to. All right, so yeah... There is the update on our war assets. We are below what is needed for an optimal outcome. I don't understand how. I mean, maybe it's because I did some renegade choices instead of paragon ones. I don't know. But, you know, we have done a thorough, I consider, thorough playthrough of the game. I'm sure I do. All right. Well, we are going to read our messages and... We will continue with what may be the conclusion of Mass Effect 3. This has been a ride. I mean, I've been at this for, I think, about a year now for, with the entire trilogy. And we are so close to the end. All right, people, this is Hill. And I'm out.